Hi guys and welcome to Daily Scuba News, which today is sponsored by Scuba Diver Magazine, but more about them later. So the Second World War was a pretty bad time for, you know, most people, if not everybody, but it seems that we're still feeling the effects of the Second World War nearly 75 years later. Uh, at the end of the war, Swiss authorities needed to dispose of around 1,500 tons of ammunition, um, so where else? They, they look to a nearby lake, um, and more specifically Lake Geneva in Switzerland to, you know, hide it and, you know, make it Why go is away. it? Why is it, when it comes to war or hiding stuff, they always choose a lake, like it's Agent just Orange, out of Canadian, like, the, the, the shameful Canadian jet Oh, the, plane yeah, the thing. secret plane. Mm -hmm, that didn't exist. Out, just... out of sight, out of mind. mind yeah. <laughs> but anyway, wind the clocks forward. You like doing these with these scripts. I've winded yeah. the black, I've winded them forward. Anyway, I wind them forward to... Good old 2019, because it's been an amazing year, uh, and scuba divers have been using this lake as their training area. Uh, when they heard rumours of uh, sunken explosives, of course, curiosity got the better of them, and they went to go and see if the rumours were true. Uh, they performed several dives, and in one area around about the 45 to 55 metre mark, uh, they actually found plenty of crates of ammunition open and <laughs> exposed to the water before they, you know, swiftly got out of the water. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah. Um, so they obviously told people about this, and the uh, the association Odysseus 3.1, which works to protect aquatic environments. I prefer 3.0. Uh, that no. was a much better update. <laughs> Uh, so Odysseus 3.1, so they uh, they protect aquatic environments. They've raised concerns, obviously, over <laughs> these explosives uh, for, for two reasons. Uh, basically, the lake is used for drinking water for nearby towns, um, and there's also, you know, a gas pipeline that runs underwater right next to these crates. Uh. So there's either chemicals leaching into the water that can affect local towns drinking water and you know if any of these explosives exploded then the explosive gas pipeline is you know also at risk so swiss authorities however say that the ammunition isn't a threat because it's enclosed in chests oh. and is well buried under sediment um but uh, you know scuba divers have uh, proved that to be wrong <clears throat> Before we go on to read the ad, which is next, I'm just going to say is maybe if they can move the explosives away from the pipe, trigger it, blow it up, the lake's going to be deeper. You've got more water can go in for the yeah. drinking, and you've got a deeper dive. Yeah, it's no longer 55, now it's down to 70. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's all you need. Anyway, Scuba Diver Magazine is a monthly publication which is available to most countries, and it covers the latest uh, news stories, so you can keep up to date with the latest news in and around the scuba diving industry. Scuba Diver also covers all three aspects of modern scuba diving, training, travel, and equipment, with how-to guides and reviews on their latest gear and trends. Yes, so you can also join the discussion over at scubadivermag.com with plenty of articles, news stories, dive site reviews and advice as well. To find out more about Scuba Diver Magazine, just click on the link pinned in the comments below. Okay, so back to the story. The Swiss Federal Department of Defense, Civil Protection and Sports, I was going to say space for a second there, that <laughs> would be awesome, or the DDPS, you could have just put that one in, Mark, uh, has, you know, repeatedly stated these dumped explosives do not release harmful substances and that they're recovery is unnecessary. We can all relax, guys. We can all sleep easy. How do you say that? Odysseus? Odysseus. Odysseus 3.1 and local divers dispute this, obviously, because they found them. And um, they train them. And, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and the parliamentary session is scheduled to be held in December to decide what should be done regarding these unexploded, corroded explosives. Yeah, I, I wouldn't like to. I mean, it's bad enough on like Thistlegorm, there's a whole bunch of these bombs and whatnot, and people are like rubbing it to kind of like see the markings on it. You're like, ugh, it's been, there, look, it's been there for ages. It would have been, you know. Yeah, but one day it's just gonna go, you know what? <laughs> and it'll be like the scene out of um, Looney Tunes. You just get a little cloud of the <laughs> That'd be it, gone. Anyway, what do you guys think? Where did you learn to dive? Um, could there have been unexploded bombs around there, do yeah. you reckon? Favishing pool, mate, it's pretty, pretty dangerous. <laughs> I mean, where I learned to dive, it was a uh, it was an old brick 
quarry. So there's just a bunch of bricks down there. That, that was about it. Nice. That and a few um, like wrecks. There was a double decker bus, which was quite cool. But yeah, How'd I, that get there? I don't think. I think crazy, they, crazy. Yeah, yeah. He's had enough. Took the wrong turn. And <laughs> followed his sat nav, <laughs> and now he's like 40 meters underwater. Still there. Uh, anyway, have you dived in Lake Geneva? Are you suddenly feeling uh, a little bit more lucky <laughs> yeah. now that you made it out without severe barrier trauma? Uh, anyway, let's discuss in the comments below. If you enjoyed this, then don't forget to subscribe. Mm. If you're new to the channel, thank you for watching, and of course, safe diving. Yeah, there's a lot of unsubscribed people who watch this video. Please subscribe. Please, 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 please. I like my job. <laughs> Stop using it right now. I see you. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Stop using it. And more information obviously can be found in the links below on Atomic's website. So yeah, go check out the regs. Stop it. Put it down. <laughs> Don't use it. Thanks for watching. And as always, stay classy, scoop. Seriously, stop it. <laughs> <laughs>